Hello, so Twitter is adding podcasting into this platform. <clears throat> and this redesign introduces personalized hubs for users called stations that group content together based on different topics such as news, music, sports, and more. I'm just reading here through the TechCrunch. And now you will be able to access personalized selection of live and recorded spaces. Uh, and the, these hubs will also feature the most popular podcast from around the world. So for example, here is some preview. In the spaces tab, which is in the, in the bottom middle, you will tap and you will access either live spaces, which is like live audio chats, but also like some podcasts like on Spotify, which you can see here, for example, pivot and all of that uh, once you come across podcasts you can give a podcast a thumbs up or thumbs down to let twitter know if content is interesting to you and once you open spaces tab you will see three sections the top of the tab will show you stations you scroll horizontal and showcase different themes and topics to listen to below that you will see spaces spotlight which lists some of the top curated audio content and then you will see a list of upcoming spaces um, so yeah, Twitter was testing this podcast edition for the uh, latest several months uh, and people were already noticing that. So it, it isn't exactly like a surprise. Uh, so here you, you would see that in the, uh, that uh, there will be like podcast tab in the, in the Twitter app. Uh, so yeah, that's basically that. Uh, initial tests indicated that Twitter was working on dedicated podcast tab, but today's launch shows that Twitter is instead interested in making podcasts a part of Spaces instead of giving them their own home on the platform. So this beta release is just visible to a group of global English speaking audiences on iOS and on Android starting just like two days ago from when this video is published so <clears throat> uh, so twitter says its internal research indicates that 45 percent of people who use twitter in the us also listen to podcasts monthly uh, so now the company will automatically suggest podcasts to help users discard content based on topics they're interested in um, so there you have it some of the also some previews here how it may look like it's pretty fun it starts to look like spotify uh, and it's definitely trying to tap into this uh, audio space uh, with live audio conversations, recorded conversations, and now podcasts. Uh, also, like uh, uh, Twitter's entrance into the world comes as matters. Facebook recently shut down its podcast service barely a year after its launch. So. There you have it. Hope this is helpful.